Okay. The first time we've seen this type in the flying at Riyadh in the service of this particular air arm from the Hungarian Air Force, the Mil Mind 24. NATO NATO. This really is one of the quintessential weapons from the long-running years of tension between East and West. This extremely rugged, extremely capable battlefield helicopter with a very, very distinctive profile to it. German Air Arms didn't have a huge amount of use for the Heinz, so a number were passed to Hungary. First of all, the Hungarians put them into storage. Later, they decided they should enter service, and in 2003 to 4, they overhauled them and brought them back to flying condition. Now, in 2013, when they were retired at the end of their existing air freight lives, that could have been it. But in 2017, it was decided by the Hungarian military to restore them to service again, and they were sent to major overhaul in St. Petersburg. They started coming back in September 2018, and this extremely menacing power scheme that Mark referred to is the result. Of the course, they've been upgraded, with English language displays in the cockpit, computer system offering integrated access to the crew, to the navigation and communication systems in there as well. Going you how the aircraft is able to get into and out of confined spaces 
and with the manoeuvrability, how weapons, whether they be foresighted or off foresighted weapons, can be brought to bear upon the enemy. Hungary now plans to keep its fleet of planes in service until 2025, and their role to be. Hungarian service, the main weapons of 0.5 inch Yak B rotary machine gun, they use the GSA 36 twin barrel cannon, the SA guided rockets, or Sturm anti armor missiles. Thank you. 